Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So I've got an unbagging to do today and this one has come to me from the good people at FG Normal. Um, I have worked with them before and they asked if I would like some more products to show you. So I said yes, of course. I love the last ones I got. So let's have a look and see what we got. So two coming out at once. So we've got, oh, that just might be a special drill. It wouldn't be a Liz unbagging without a special drill. I think that's becoming my new catchphrase. <laughs> And another one, and oh, another one. So, wow, okay. Uh, there's quite a few special offers on at the moment. Uh, we'll have a look at this one first, I think. Uh, so on the website at the moment, um, if you buy four paintings, you will get one of them free. So if there's three or four that you've been thinking, mm, shall I get it, shan't I? You can get one of them free now, which is brilliant and £40 give you free delivery as well. Uh, obviously that's at the time of me looking on the website just before I've made this video so always double check what offers are on there when you actually go shopping but yeah we are like free and discounts and everything so go and have a check out there's some great stuff on there and it was very very difficult to choose which ones to uh, get this time because I think my list was just so long but uh, yeah I've still got a wish list <laughs> oh dear the amount of diamond paintings that I've actually got and I've still got a wish list anyway I just love pretty and sparkly what can I say so this one is a special and I have seen a few people uh, doing these and looking at these and it's a beautiful seahorse or to give it its proper name, a hippocampus. Hippocampus. I think that's how we pronounce it. <laughs> okay, look at that. And it's like a little bit of sort of a narrower one and a little bit longer. So I thought, oh, quite nice. And uh, yeah, I do quite fancy getting the full set of these because I think there's about three or four. So maybe three would look quite nice. Um, my bathroom is just going to be absolutely full of sea themed things, which it is water. So what can I say? Wow, this has 20 different gems and colours. Goodness me, that is a lot of different colours and gems on this. It says it's a 25 centimetre by 40 centimetre, so we'll give it a measure in a second. Let's just see if we can flatten it out a little bit. Okay, flatten it out. So yeah, I love this. Uh, I've seen a couple completed and they just look so sparkly. Um, I do try and get things that you might not have seen before, but uh, sometimes I just have to give in and think, well, I just love that and I'm going to have to have it. <laughs> and as I say, there are quite a few different ones, so you might not have seen this one. So we've got our uh, little basic toolkit, your starter toolkit with your pen, uh, your plastic tweezers, your book and your wax. And yes, I have found a use for the plastic tweezers. Yay! So, okay, that's uh, standard as usual. Oh, let's give it a measure. We said we'd uh, give it a measure. Uh, at the moment on the website, this one is $4.57. Sorry, I've not done the conversion. I might have to start doing conversions. Uh, but it, this is actually 20 centimetres, which is 8 inches. So it is that little bit thinner, but it is longer. And it's 13 and 3 quarter inches, which is 35 centimetres. Okay, so yeah, it's the same as uh, most sort of special drill and poured glue canvases where your whole canvas is your size and your actual drilling area, your picture area is just that little bit smaller. But as I think most websites now are actually, if you scroll through the different pictures that they show you, show you your different measurements. So, you know, th there's no confusion. Uh, but yeah, look at that. I can't believe there's 20 colours in this. It's going to be really different and sparkly. Okay, so let's get into these gems and have a look. Oh, I can see flowers. Oh, this is going to be great. Okay, and I got into that straight away, did you see? I actually managed to get into it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Just seen something that I've never seen before. Oh, wow. Okay, let's start at this end. Let's start at wow, 20 colours. Goodness me. Okay, so we have this lovely sparkly silver. 
I love it when the silvers are so clear. They practically they sort of reflect the blue packet so they look really bluey clear. And then we've got some slightly larger of your clears. And then we've got lemony gold. And that looks like that's a medium size. So we've got three different sizes in your clear there. Okay, so that's, that's always a good sort of basic sparkle added in. Oh, look at these. We've got an AB already, which is like a orangey reddy colour and it's got an a b coating which is aurora borealis basically an iridescent coating over the top of a sparkly gem just to give it a few more colours and a little bit more shine and then we've got a, a medium purple and a larger purple there and we have a larger gold Ooh. and a small purple so with three oh no that's a different colour i was going to say with three sizes in the purple but that is actually a darker purple than the, the other two. Okay. Oh, look at those. We have three huge gems. Wow. They're like massive teardrops. I don't think I've seen any as big as that before. And uh, we've got only two needed on the canvas. So we've got one spare. Yay. Love spares. <gasps> hot pink. Hot pink. Can I ever get a canvas without hot pink on? What can I say? Well, most of my Scotty Dog ones don't have to have pink, hot pink on, but yeah, look at that hot pink. So we've got some small teardrops in silver. And then we've got some, oh, large red ovals. They're a different one as well. An oval shaped gem. Nice. Ah, right. Okay. So here's our other purples. So we've got another purple there. And that does look like, is that the same colour as that one? It is, so we have got the three sizes in that one. They've just put it a lot further apart just to confuse me. But yeah, we've got the three sizes in that one. So your basic sort of like main background colour is your like purpley, your lilac -y purple colour and your silver. And then everything else is just added in just to enhance it. <gasps> oh, look, we've got some of those little like half sphere like golds. So they're pretty. I do like the gold. Just that sphere just that flash of gold and then a larger slightly larger gold faceted round there and then look at these flowers we've got little purple flowers we've got bigger sort of lilac -y flowers so that matches in with one of the purple colors and that matches in with the one that's the three and then look at those i have never seen those before you can't quite see it but that's like an iridescent coating on that gold and purple. And you can just see all different colours in it. It's just amazing. I just love it. Oh, wow. So, yeah, these are actually flat back gems look that you could use in bead making because they've still got the holes in. But once it's on your canvas, you won't actually see the holes. But, yeah, we do like to repurpose. I have noticed crafters will always find something and repurpose it. So where do these gorgeous colours go then? All right, look. So number 20 is there, there, there and there. So the centre's five and we only need four. Yay! And then number 19 is there and there. So do we only need two of those and we've got five? No, there must be some others somewhere. I'm just not seeing them. And then the little ones are number 18. There's one there, there's one there, there's one there. So there's quite a few of those scattered about as well, but... This is going to look stunning. And as I say, I think I might have to get the others. But yeah, a new gem that I've never seen before. You just can't believe it, can you? How many different gems uh, that they actually are. All the different colours and styles and everything. So yay! Put these back in the packet. So that's canvas number one. Okay, lovely that. Absolutely gorgeous. I like that we've got the star here as well. I suppose this is a starfish and it's got all little gems and different sizes on it as well. And then just the little, I presume these will be clear. So they're like little bubbles. So it's swimming and it's got little bubbles because they sort of swim sideways, don't they? You know, they don't go up and down. They sort of go sideways. And yeah, I know what I mean. <laughs> Okay, let's have a look at the one in the packet next. Okay, where's my scissors? Scissors! Lovely sparkly scissors. Okay, oh, can't get it open. 
fingers and thumbs. There it is. Okay, just give it a sit near to the top there. I don't want to ruin my canvas. So let's have a look and see what this one is. Okay. Oh, this one's a full drill. But it's only a little one. Okay, it's kind of a bit squished. Oh, and it's coming bags, look. Grip seal bags. So anybody that likes the grip seal bags and doesn't want to kit up into little jars or tubs or whatever, then you have got all your colours all kitted up for you ready. Excellent. Uh, another basic toolkit, your pen, your boat and your wax there. Okay, just pop those out of the way. And this one is, look at that. It's coming up to that time of year. So we have some Christmas baubles. And it just spoke to me, this one. I just saw it and I thought, oh, I love that. I just absolutely love it. The expressions, it's just so happy and smiley. And if you're going to have something stuck on your wall at Christmas, you want it to be happy and smiley. Okay, just give it a flatten now. Right, just bend that slightly as well. Once the drills go on your full drill ones, you do tend to find that they do flatten. Um, it's only your partials that sometimes don't quite. And uh, yes, at request, I will be doing an iron video. I can't believe I said that. So yeah, watch this space. Um, I will be doing some ironing of canvases to show you um, how I do it. And then you can let me know if you would do it any different. <laughs> Okay, I can't believe I'm actually going to film me ironing as well. It's just unheard of. So, back to this canvas. Oh, this one's 20 colours as well. Popular colour today. Popular number, I mean. Uh, it's all capital letters and numbers, it looks like. And we do have DMC codes. So, yeah, that looks pretty good. And it's a nice clear drill feel. There's dark colours. Are showing up really nice and clear. There's nothing blurry there. Okay, look at that. But look at Santa, that little face. It looks like he's blowing a kiss. <laughs> and the snowman smiling away, and Rudolph here. Uh, I think he might be crying out for some air bees on his nose, so he sparkles just a little bit more. And then with all the snowflakes in the background, look. But yeah, that's gorgeous. So it's just three hanging baubles. I just thought, oh, what a lovely, happy little painting to do. So a quick measure and see where we are. Yep, we're uh, 25 centimetres, which is nine and three quarter inches. By 25 centimetres, which is nine and three quarter inches, roughly. Okay, very nice. I like that. Very pretty. Okay. And the price of this one was a £4.57 as well. So a bit of a theme going here. 20 colours, 20 colours, same price. <laughs> okay, just a quick flick at these colours. I think you can more or less see them in the bag. But yeah, 20. Okay. So we've got a purpley colour and they're all in order as well. So I'll try and keep them in order. And like a coral colour. And a dark brown and another corally colour. Very different colours, these. And a very light pink and a blue. And, oh, quite a big bag of blue. But I'm thinking that that's going to be a lot of the background. Because there is quite a bit of colour blocking for the background. OK, I'm trying desperately to keep these in order. And, like, an orangey colour. And a fawn colour. And then, what's that one? That one's dark blue. That's 939. Oh, and we have the canvas number on each bag. And we also have the DMC number as well, which is excellent. We have your like, russet colour. And a denim blue. And another darker blue, like a midnight blue. Okay, the drill's looking pretty good as well. And then a baby pink. It always amazes me. What colours, I know I say it all the time, but what colours that you get and then when you put them on the canvas you think, well, where did that colour go? I'm sure there was that colour in there, but once it blends in, oop. <laughs> oh, let me just throw everything all over. 
<laughs> Why does it blend in with everything? I'm trying to be serious here. Hands, behave yourself. Uh, once it blends in with everything, then uh, yeah, the colours just sort of like merge and disappear. It's brilliant. Love it. That's why I love diamond painting. It just uh, surprises me all the time, particularly when the drills decide to disappear off the edge of the desk. <laughs> okay, so these are like all orangey, russety colours. Oh, a lovely Christmassy red there. And then a little bit of grey for your shading. Okay. So very nice. Two very good paintings. Okay, thank you, FG Normal. I am enjoying these. They are all lovely. So then the last one, I think you can probably tell we've got a star here. So I think you can probably guess what this one is. But and this is a nice soft plastic bag, so I ain't gonna have trouble getting into this one. Okay, oh, just trouble getting it out instead. <laughs> all right. So we oh this is a soft canvas that one's a little bit stiff that one's sort of a medium and this is a very soft one so okay we've got our toolkit again pen boat wax and your little plastic tweezers okay and then look this one's all special drills as well and goodness me look at that you haven't seen any before and then talk them at once <laughs> Oh, we've got a hot pink. Yay! <laughs> and this one is this beautiful Christmas tree. And I have had my eye on this one for a while and I've been saying, nope, 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 don't get any more trees. And then I gave in and I thought, I'm going to have a tree. I'm going to have to have that tree. It's just so pretty. Uh, it is on a white background, so I may or may not cut it out. Um, I did go on a little shopping trip yesterday and I did get some foam board, so I may or may not be doing that. I was just thinking, oh, these are strange, but I think this is snow. I was thinking, oh, just like showing the background through the uh, canvas, but actually I think these are snow on the leaves. Yes, it is. It's snow. So that's good. So it's not a bad shape once it's got all its drills on to cut out because you won't be going all the way into these bits because that is your snow. Quite a reasonable shape to cut or you can just have it as your picture. Um, you could even put some little stars on it, you know, because um, I, I don't know about you, but because I love doing specials, I've got a lot of gold or silver stars left over from quite a few of my packets. So you could just put a little blob of uh, your PVA glue or some of your sealer and uh, just pop it onto the canvas and put some stars in the background and that would really shimmer. That would look very, very pretty. This one is 22 different gems and colours, so just a few more on this one. And this says it's a 30 by 40, but I think it probably will be a 25 by 35, but we will have a look and see. Uh, yeah, we are at 25 centimetres and nine and three quarter inches. I'll be saying that in my sleep, won't I? <laughs> and it is, yeah, just ooh, roughly 35 centimetres, mm, 13 and three quarter ish inches. Okay. okay, it's not quite flattened out enough to give you an exact measurement, but it's just to give you a rough idea as to what size you're getting. But yeah, this is a very soft canvas, very nice. Okay, looking at some of the different gem sizes on this and thinking there's going to be some lovely ones on here. Okay, so look at that beautiful Christmas tree. Wow, I do like Christmas trees and I like traditional as well. I like it when you've got all your different colours. Our Christmas tree is always, uh, because I collect glass Christmas tree toys, so our Christmas tree is very traditional with all different colours and different items on it. It's not one of these where it's all pink or all black or whatever. Ours is you know, the old fashioned type one. Uh, well, old fashioned as they call it. I'm sure if I keep everything long enough, it'll all come back round in fashion again. <laughs> like flares <laughs> okay let's have a look at the gems wow so 22 different ones okay are they all at gosh they're all in one long snake as well okay so with these lovely purpley blue colour that's gorgeous a very like ice pale blue some small uh, teardrops in red 
an orangey amber colour and a slightly larger green gem there. Hot pink, said there's a hot pink, calling hot pink again. And we've got two sizes of your red round, larger rounds. Red round. Oh no, it's not all in one snake. Look, up, it's dropped off the end. <laughs> Can't see for looking. Okay, so we've got another blue there. And, oh, that's a nice green. What's that? It's like a lemony green, that one. And then a palish gold and a lovely bright Christmassy cherry red there. Okay. Behave, behave. Oh, look. <laughs> Stay in rows. Right. And then we have this lovely purple again there, like a royal purple. And another pale gold. And that gorgeous clear silver. And look, I say it's those little flowers again. So where do they go? That's number 16. So number 16. Oh, look, it's here. So we've got four of them. And they've sent us five again. We've got another spare. Yay. <laughs> and then we've got our pink marquees. That's a lovely baby pink colour. And we've got three stars. So where do the stars go then? What number is that? That is number 18. Oh, right. It's in the middle of the star at the top. Oh, so we've got three and we only need one. That's great. I mean, particularly if you're like me and you drop them down the side of the settee or the chair arm while you're down and painting. It's good to have spares. We've got these lovely, um, like, orangey, amber-coloured roses. Uh, they've got an AB coating on. Okay, so that one is number 19. So that's the yellow one here. So we're going to have spares again. And then we've got these little pretty pale blue, uh, like little daisy type flowers. And they're number nine. No, they're number 20. Number 19, number 20. So we only need two of those. And we've got quite a few. And then some little okay, marquees, yet yeah, tiny marquees in a pale pink. And then a pale pink, just crystal round to finish off. So, yay, some great ones there. I love getting the specials and getting all the different ones. It's the magpie in me coming out, anything sparkly and shiny. Okay, these away. Okay, and the price of this one is $5.72. Pence, uh, cents, sorry, not pence, because it's in dollars. <laughs> okay, so a nice little uh, haul here from FG Normal. Uh, we've got our lovely Christmas tree, our little characters and our Christmas baubles and then our very sparkly and lovely little seahorse there. How cute is that? Okay. Right. Well, thank, thank you, you ever so much to FG Normal for sending me these to show you. Say so check out the website with all the special offers on. Uh, Say so buy four, get one free. Wow. I love a freebie. And if, if you have enjoyed looking at these with me, as always, a thumbs up is much appreciated. If you've got any comments or questions, if you leave them in the comments down below. And if you want to come back and see what I get up to next, then if you press that subscribe button and the all notifications bell next to it, you'll be notified when any of my videos come out. So thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.